Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to BFL Reacts. Welcome back to more DuckTales 2017. Last time we had the 87 cent solution, which was a, a good episode with a great back half, uh, especially as a Glomgold fan. Uh, some really excellent petty Glomgold in that. You finally got a bit of a dub, and it was kind of nice to see, even though, <laughs> uh, I don't know, seeing him fail is uh, perhaps a bit better. I guess he, he did end up failing in the end. But today's episode is of the Golden Spear, which uh, you would assume is probably Della Duck. You know, the last time we saw her, you know, the Spear of Longinus, obviously. And uh, it was gold-powered, and then she was with these alien people who were a bit sus don't quite trust them definitely excited to see more della uh she's kind of like the uh the big thing <laughs> i guess right at least for this season uh, the, the, the first season too although the first season my dog barked kind of shared you know the focus with magica so let's go ahead and hop into this episode i wonder if we're gonna get home this episode the golden sphere would make me think that she has built a new ship completely comprised out of gold i don't know if that is a practical uh <laughs> material for a spaceship especially since don't things get quite hot upon re-entry into the atmosphere and uh, I feel like gold has like a relatively low melting point, but it is also a cartoon with talking ducks and she chewed gum to, to not die. <laughs> so let's check it out. <laughs> oh, she's being watched. Yo, girl, look at the screen. How'd you, look at your family. Twitter.com. My man is in his end state. What is going to happen? Children happen. Oh shit. Ooh, that's a lot of feathers. <laughs> Bro, that's why I wear a hat. Why does she have a Necronomicon? Why do you need to watch this? Don't worry about it, Donald. Just don't worry about it. Oh no. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> they pinched his ass. I'll rewrite history. I accidentally like bass boosted my headset with a button. That's why I look shocked. <laughs> the hero of the planet Moon. Which is technically not a planet, so Moon Moon. Planet Moon. <laughs> Girl, oh, Betty, calm down. She is a warrior with no war to fight. Oh. Who's got an extended <laughs> vacay, huh? What are you going to do now? Seethe. She say seethe? Cope and seethe? <laughs> Go back to your mysterious project. I am definitely not suspicious of you. <laughs> what do you mean mysterious? She's building a rocket ship. <laughs> I think I spy the green-eyed monster of jealousy. Uh-oh. She's trying to convince you all she's your friend to distract you from some devious attack. I like her. I like this Penny, even though she's probably going to be an antagonist. <laughs> Does Della look like a threat to you? I bet she is very she's capable. She's squishy and easily defeatable. If you would just let me. I will not spend my life in fear of them, Benumbra. I hope people will see that in time. So oh. You. I tell you, she will not rest until she wreaks havoc on our planet. I like the guy, though. Poor thing. He's respectful. Benumbra. She's staying with you. That's an order. Okay, well that seemed a bit sinister, but I'm looking forward to them rooming. Oh my god. <laughs> cool designs. The Evil Dead. We're getting even more explicit with it, huh? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> He's gonna rip your hairline down with him. Get back to rest. It did rip his airline. Poor Donald, my man is gonna be <laughs> totally featherless by the end. <laughs> Spider Verse? I can't blame him. I'd be hella paranoid too. You shall never find solace. Oh no! <laughs> oh god, the comb over. Guess uh. who's a god now? What? Uh? I was thinking Storkules might show up to bother him. <laughs> oh, let's go! 
suddenly sees the sandals of Hermes from my chest <laughs> and is now messenger of the god. Okay, Hermes. I knew it was someone. Is it duity on the black? <laughs> bad, bad pun, bad pun. Father has declared war on Dewey Duck. <laughs> we totally got this. Uh -huh. Ow, the lightning burns. There's so many episodes. Oh my god. Fried duck. There's so many episodes worth of content. We're just blasting through. All in a day in Duckburg. Lunaris told me you so generously volunteered to put me up. I was like, well, He said it was her idea, friend, too. Right? Look at your cute little spear. That was my childhood training spear. I used it to defend my home from unwanted pests. Okay, girl. No one, no one asked. <laughs> Boring. We both have spears. That's neat. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No! <laughs> I feel bad for her. Della is just, like, kind of a menace. Kind of like her children. I kind of love it. Treacherous imposter. Imposter? True hero living right next door. Count my lucky stars. Oh, everyone's so nice. Heard you beat the might with compassion. Compassion. <laughs> oh, oh, I love this. Is everyone going crazy? Why are you helping her? Oh. I don't know. I thought they'd be evil. Maybe Penumbra is going to keep being evil, though. I don't know. She's... She doesn't seem to get it. Shoddy. Tone down the assassination Shenanigan. attempts. <laughs> anyway, the moon is safe and beautiful and has everything you could possibly want. Earth envy. That's gonna drive Penumbra crazy. And because the Earth has wonders large and small. The pyramids, the humpback whale, slap bracelets. What is <laughs> slap bracelets. bracelets? Girl, when did she disappear? The early 2000s? When I get back, I'm gonna show my boys every inch of it. It'll be like Aww. I never left. They're we'll already exploring pretty well. Oh. The hidden pyramid of Toth okay, uh, yikes, girl, you're kind of missing out on a lot. She did miss out on, like, most of the adolescence of her children. Hey, Beardo, are you a no. Hey, no, I don't. Do. Yeah, <laughs> I'm on Zeus's side. <laughs> Strike this child down. This episode has really good pacing. I enjoy the cutting back and forth. Your orders were to see that our guest has a pleasant stay. I don't think getting speared would be very pleasant, do you? Tell her off. Just a little. But I kind of like her still. <laughs> she is filling their heads with earth lies and making me, I, I mean us, the moon seem inferior by comparison. She's sharing the wonders of her culture. Yeah, you're kind of projecting, girl. I think you're insecure of your planet. Why all she has to do is flip this little switch to launch the spear into space. Remarkable. You have to think about the big picture, Penumbra. Uh-oh. Okay. That dude is hella evil. Penumbra is going to, uh, defect to Della's side. That's my guess. Why are you trespassing in my togs, goat? I'm no goat. This is merely my terrestrial form. What the <laughs> fuck? The laws of man oh, no. The ethereal realm of <laughs> oh, no. Kings. Let's just pretend that, uh, never happened. Dude, uh, Louie! <laughs> Oh God, Scrooge! They should know better than this. Oh, her hair. Let me see the hair. It's kind of nice. Hair, hair is very important to me in a character design. Earth is so great. Why don't you just go already? Okay, well, uh, we that kind of backfired on you. We could get our very own dog. <laughs> I really wish I could take you, but it's just not possible. I thought nothing could stop the amazing <sighs> Della Duck. Shut the fuck up. I hate you. She snores. <gasps> she snores? Oh no, <laughs> that's so offensive. It is possible. What? No. Penny's right. Let's Why go. Can't I fit you all in the spear? Let's oh, no. go. Oh, this is the least I can do. <laughs> you have no I one to blame but yourself, Anambra. <laughs> Cope and see. She's taking them all to Earth. She's destroying tranquility. Our people have to be free to make their own decisions. Maybe he's not bad. I don't know. I'm getting mixed signals from that guy. Maybe I'm just not trustworthy. <gasps> Sorry, I didn't mean to startle you. Or maybe you. I have trust issues. I, we weren't talking about you. It helped me fix my spear. It's only right that I fix yours. Aww. Thank you, Bella. That's too kind. It is very These sweet. Are my kids. Oh. Their heads aren't really shaped like eggplants. I'm not a good artist. <laughs> oh. No one could ever protect your people as well as you, Penny. Oh. But as long as they're with me, I'll try with all I've got. I promise. Yeah. That was so sweet. I'm I'm like getting a little teary-eyed. 
That was very sweet. We arranged a month-long cruise in the glassy waters of the Caribbean on the SS-40 Winks. Oh, something is going to go horribly wrong. <laughs> Non-refundable, and I will not give charity to lay about cruise companies. Do you hear me, lad? God damn, Scrooge. <laughs> is Della gonna come back while he's gone? <laughs> She's still planning to take my people to that planet of nightmare horrors tomorrow. Girl, oh, come on. Go? You were so close. Oh, are you gonna ship her away while she's sleeping? That's kind of rude. Get her on there. Oh my god, she's not gonna get left behind, is she? You're a bad actress. Oh my god. Give me the plans for the ship. We'll build a fleet and we'll follow you to Earth shortly. You've inspired my people, Della. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. Get back on there, girl. Okay, yes, very sweet. I do love Penny, kinda. Okay, I was getting nervous she was going to be left. <laughs> Alright, I gotta check. How much longer in this episode? Yo, is it gonna be this episode? Oh, she's tearing up. Oh! What the fuck? what are you doing? Oh my god, he's framing it like Della attacked him. She lured us with sad stories and fabulous falsehoods about Earth so that we'd help her rebuild her ship. Boo, you suck. And, and all those stories. They were lies too. Oh, Ooh. No. She lied to us so that she could get back to tell her fellow Earthers that we are weak. Earthers, no. Penumbra, come on. Going to hide down here and wait to be invaded? No. Or are we going to take these plans that I rustled away from the treasure as she fled and use them to build a fleet of ships and invade them first? You suck. I feel bad for the moon people. They're good. We are the moon. You are cringe. Penumbra, you know that's not right, girl. You're better. I can you tell. This all along. Why? Because he's because evil. Because <laughs> why not? Die. They needed a reason to fight. Aren't you afraid that- No! I will not spend my life in fear of the Earth like my father. The <laughs> Earth will fear me. Okay, or you could just, like, be accepting of it. She actually liked you, Penumbra. Said you reminded her of her brother. Aww. <laughs> ah. Della, Della, oh, they're reunited, and it feels so good. Let's see it. Where is she, though? Launch sequence no, activated. no, what? Minus 60. <laughs> no, this poor man. <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck? Is it actually going into space? Poor Donald. I'm home. Don't in there. You kidding me with this? What? <laughs> that was a good one, dude. That mm -mm. mm -mm. was a good one. Rip rap. Rup. What the fuck? Rip rap and rup? <laughs> is that the triplets in whatever language is this? <laughs> Okay, so this episode was really good. Um, uh, moon people, I don't know. I mean, it was obvious something was off with them. I kind of flipped, flopped back and forth what, what was going to happen. I knew they weren't trustworthy completely. Obviously, Penny Penumbra was rather explicit with her distrust, but she did come around uh, slowly but surely through exposure to Della and Della just being such an overwhelmingly uh, kind person, even though... I could kind of feel Penny's <laughs> frustration, you know, just having her constantly talk about these stories. But at the same time, if I was on a different planet with a or on the moon with moon people, I'd be like, yeah, Earth, let me tell you all about Earth, especially if I had an adventurer's life. But if you had a dislike for the Earth, even if it was irrational, obviously that would kind of rub you the wrong way. So I can see where she's coming from. But she came around and the king their leader i don't know what his title is uh not a great guy <laughs> i was kind of sus of him a little bit but i wasn't quite sure if it, if it was going to go in that direction but it did he's a dickhead he's uh i really hate him actually i i quite like penny i like her i'm very interested to see what comes of this you would assume that eventually um he will be dethroned after probably invading earth 
right? And Penumbra will be the new leader? Possibly, probably. Uh, Because she's obviously going to defect because she knows that Della is kind. She's the only one that actually knows that right now. But the question is, what is going to happen to their leader, that dude? Whose name I do not remember. <laughs> Let's kill him. Fuck it. I hate him. I want him to die. I wonder if he will see the error in his ways or what is going to eventually happen to him. My guess is season finale. That's my guess. <laughs> but next episode, we obviously get a Della reunion with her family. Uh, minus Donald? What's going on with that man Donald? I feel bad for that poor man. He launched into possibly space we didn't see him like leave the atmosphere he kind of went off into the horizon at an angle where i'm not entirely sure if he went into space or if he's just gonna like fly over the ocean or something right anyways very much looking forward to that i mentioned this during the reaction i quite love the pacing of this episode felt very rapid uh back and forth between earth and the moon uh, very natural, uh, very good, <laughs> very, very good. One of one of the better episodes, I would say, of the show and, and the season. But I feel like I say that really often with this show because I think it's just a really good show. <laughs> Next episode is Nothing Can Stop Della Duck. Yay, I guess she's just going to be part of the main cast now. Hopefully we see her more than Donald. And honestly, hopefully we see Donald more because I love that man. But I will catch you guys with that one next time. And until then... Peace.